everyone, Amber from the Vault here. Welcome back to The Witcher 3 Wild Hunt. We're going to go ahead and just jump right back in. Don't forget, though, that you can always check me out over on Twitter at Amber from the Vault, spelled the same way as here. No O in from, no E in the. There's also a few links in the description of this video if you would like to help keep the channel running. We're going to go ahead and just jump right back into the game. We'll see you back in just a sec. All right, ladies and gentlemen, so here we are. We're back at uh, Roach's camp. Witcher. We're going to talk to him, see what we're going to do. We're doing that quest, an eye for an eye, so we'll see what he needs us oh. to do. Where is he? Oh, he's back here. Okay. Hey, buddy. Geralt of Rivia, safe and sound. Mentioned you have a problem. Mm-hmm. It's Vess. She took a couple of lads across the river. She plans to hit the black ones at Mulberdale. So, sounds about like what guerrilla fighters do. Yes, when they're ordered to. Whereas I forbade her from leaving camp. Indefinitely. Don't trust Vess anymore? Bollocks. She's prepared to die for me. Ah, that's not the problem. Know what distinguishes a soldier from a common swashbuckler? The uniform. It's a serious question. A rhetorical one. So instead of waiting for an answer, just enlighten me. Soldiers think tactically. They know when to strike, when to fall back, when to charge and when to hold. Vess finds this difficult. She's impulsive, hot-headed. Yet in guerrilla warfare, one false step and you're fucked. I confined her to the camp because I feared that sent out, she'd go rabid and make a mistake. I was right. Why Mulberry Dale? Why'd Vess go there? The peasants from the village aided us earlier. The Nilfgaardians learned of this. Word got out they're planning a punitive expedition. Probably hang every fifth villager. Hmm. Honestly, Vess's desire to save the villagers makes sense. What doesn't is your opposition to the plan. War means death. Not only for the soldiers, for the common folk as well. You can't save them all, it's that simple. Funny. Had you for an idealist. You were right to. Are right to. But I have one ideal. A free Temeria. And I'm prepared to sacrifice anything for it. All right, so you've got a problem. Insubordination. What am I supposed to do about it? I doubt Vess has entered the village. More likely she and the boys lie in wait in the woods nearby. We must find her before she attacks and stop her. You're a good tracker. Help me. Count me in. Thanks, Geralt. I'll owe you a favor. Meet me in Velen beneath the Hanged Man's Tree. It's just a short jaunt from there to Mulberrydale. One false move. It's the village below. Black with Nilf guardians already. They're preparing to execute folk. No sign of Vess. Ah, she may be impetuous, but she's not stupid. She's waiting for her moment. Probably attack after dusk once. Shh. What now? A trio, lightly equipped, sneaking closer. Over there, near the. Death to the black ones! Help me, Circa! Looks like we're too late. Oh shit, now we gotta go fight on her behalf? Yeah, follow you, but where are you? There we go. You can run a little faster and a little, uh, uh, smoother there. I've been to this place multiple times, and... I guess I never even thought about it. Oh shit, we gotta actually protect that bitch? Oh man, you gotta be kidding me. She fucked up! And came here when she shouldn't have. But now I gotta protect her. Jeez. I'm glad you're angry, Vess. I'm glad you care about your people. I care about your people, too, if I'm honest. But... Do I have time to run around uh, loot bodies? Uh, cause you know, I got a thing where I loot bodies. Uh, that's kind of my thing. Okay, hold on, hold on. I know, I'm so sorry, I'm so sorry, I'm so sorry. 
I know you guys are probably like, oh my god, Amber, you don't have to loot all the bodies. The truth is, I do, I do, I have to loot them all. Because you never know what you're going to come across. And I'm also starting to run out of money. So, I gotta be looting. Okay, come around the back side here. What, is she still- oh shit, she's still being hit and I'm over here. Well, guess who's gonna fuck this up? She gonna die because of me. She's gonna die because I had the loot. That's okay, I think I'm gonna die too. Oh my god, she's alive. <laughs> God's damn it, Bess. Have you gone completely mental? You ignore my orders, go off on a suicide mission, and instead of donning a breastplate, you dash into battle, shirt open, navel and whatnot exposed. You're not my father, Roach. You've no right to tell me what to wear. But I am your commander, and you will obey me. Guerrilla warfare. Warfare! It involves armies, for fuck's sake. I could not abandon them. They helped us. It's a soldier's job to kill, Bess, not save, not rescue. If that is not to your liking, join the Sisters of Militale. Study to be a healer. Fucking hell. Give me your weapon. You'll get it back when you wise up. If you wise up. Move out! Ren. <coughs> <coughs> yourselves a prisoner we don't take prisoners you took my weapon roach so I must manage with my bare hands leave him alone there are corpses enough here what you heard me I did and I can't believe it he came here to murder civilians he's seen us will you have him return to his camp and report Emir knows we can kill his men let him learn that we can also show mercy Oh shit, this is hard. Um, let me think about this. Because he's, he's right. They would be able to tell him. Oh man, they would be able to tell uh, uh, the, the dude. Oh god, we like killed people, you know. It is called Eye for an Eye though. And I think she is an idiot. Let's just address that the whole shirt open down to her navel thing. That's some dumb ass bullshit. Uh, I blame the game for that, though. But hey, at least they threw somebody in here who's like, you're a fucking idiot. Um, I just, I don't know. I don't know what to do. Hmm. I don't know if it really matters. I think he's right. I, I think we should, I think we should let him go. And then, of course, you know, it, it looks better on us, too. And then we can't say that we were necessarily real aggressors, especially because in this situation, she was the aggressor. So she's the one who fucked it up. I think about these Roach way too much. Right. Besides killing a defenseless. What is it with you, Roach? Did the Witcher take your stones? They're sadists. He's the occupier. I will explain later. You, Nilfgaardian, piss off. Morantai. Nes dirmad ava. Go, before I change my mind. See, I think that turned out well. He may even leave the army now because <sighs> of it or whatever. We should go before a patrol comes along. Thank you, Geralt. Ever need any help? You know where to find me. All right. All right, everyone. Here we are. We're going to go ahead and meet with Triss Marigold, see what she needs. Uh, something about life and death. So, I don't know. Yes. Oh. What are you here for? Uh, Triss. Hello. I told her from the start. No men, no pets. It is a decent house for decent folk. Don't worry. Won't stay long. Uh... Uh, am I a pet or am I the man? Just, just curious. Also, do you have things I can steal? I mean, you said it's a decent house. You must have some decent stuff. Thank you. I will come again. Thank you. Thank you. Okay, I better get up here. Oh. It's one of those little things over there. I'll grab that too. Don't you worry. I'm all about that loot. Seriously, I don't know what half the shit in this game is used for. I'm not very good with the alchemy stuff. If you've never noticed, I like barely even use bombs and stuff. I've just never been that kind of gamer, I guess. Like, that's just not who I am. I tend to, like, just want to fight things. Not really good at crafting stuff. Girl, I got a problem. Can we talk? Uh, that's why I came here. I mean, also to loot things, but, you know. 
The real reason I came here. Does this feel like it's all leaning to one side? Are you staying in a house that's leaning to one side? Because we should probably discuss some safety issues that I'm seeing. I can't seem to loot that one. That's fine. Sometimes there's boxes in here. I know I just missed something, but I'm okay with that. What do you want? Yes, Geralt? What did you want to talk about? I got a strange message. I don't quite know what to think. Who was it from? Ingrid Vagelbutt's servant. Apparently, Lady Vagelbutt's prepared to donate a tidy sum. She wants to help mages escape from Novigrad. Guessing this wouldn't be a selfless act of charity. You guess right. And that's my problem. Vagelbutt needs a favor from me. No details in the letter, unfortunately. I'm supposed to meet the servant at the fish market. Says he needs to explain everything face to face, but these days I can't be sure meeting him is a good idea. What are you afraid of exactly? That it's a trap. On the one hand, it's an opportunity I can't afford to let slip. We need the coin. On the other... Nobody expects you to risk your life. I expect that of myself. The thing is, it used to be easier. When I didn't know what it's like to be tortured, what it's like to hear the screams of others and be unable to do anything. You could have escaped at any time. I know, but I was still terrified. What if they fetter me in real Dime Meridian? You won't always be there to help. Oh, I don't know what to do. Um. Oh, man. If she meets up with this dude and I gotta, like, save her or something, you know? But. If she actually... Oh, my God. Because, like, I don't want people to die. Like, I don't want... Oh, here's the thing. I don't want people to die. But if... If, if um... We could actually save people, you know? Like, that'd be fine. But I'm, I'm thinking, like... If it is a trap, because she's obviously concerned it's a trap... Am I gonna lose her? You know? Um... I don't know what to do. I guess if I help her, then she can't get hurt, right? She can't get caught if I go with her. But then I'm probably gonna have to fight some people. I don't necessarily want to fight nobody. But I don't feel like we should say no. Because if we say don't go near this, she's gonna do it anyway, right? And then it's just gonna be bad because I'm not gonna be there to help her. So I guess I gotta do it. don't like this at all. But you seem determined. Not about to let you deal with it alone. Thank you. The servant. How are you supposed to contact him? Said I'd recognize him. He'll be in a blue tunic, have a load of keys strapped to his belt. I'm supposed to ask him about the price for his trout. Okay. Gotta be kidding me. He tell you to come holding a red rose? He doesn't mention flowers. But I won't refuse if you feel like giving me some. It's a fish market, Triss. Be able to get you some salted cod at best. Think it'll be better if I talk to the mystery man in the blue tunic. He's expecting to meet me. You just wait nearby. I'll make sure that note didn't come from the witch hunters. Then you come in. Mm-hmm. Fine. Let's meet there. Well, I guess... Yep, I've been roped in. Roped into helping out. This house is definitely leaning to one side. You should all probably get your foundation looked at. You need a little foundational lift here. I'm a little concerned about the structural integrity of your home. I understand you're in poverty, but really, a home that is unsafe is not a home at all. Really? I gotta fight these guys again? Well, that was easy. <laughs> that was a little too easy. I don't know, I'm just saying. Structural integrity of a home is very important for someone. Imagine, like, the things back then must have been built pretty horribly sometimes, I can imagine. I know of a house that was built in the 1970s that is literally falling apart. Because the person who built it, built it into a swamp. That's smart. I'm just saying. Okay. So I'm supposed to find somebody in a blue tunic. Lots of blue jerkins. Interesting. With a load of keys. And there's stuff to steal. And things to accidentally light on fire when you're actually trying to steal. Hmm. Okay. Looking for a man with keys. Looking for a man with keys. Wearing a blue tunic. Oh, shut up. Oh, here we go. Yeah? Know where I can get the best price on trout? Perhaps. 
but it wasn't you I was to meet, sir. Want to talk to the letter's recipient? I gotta be present. Caution would advise... Caution's advising you not to argue right now. Trust me. It seems I've got no choice. Come with me. Okay. No. This way. It's not far. Good. So where is Triss hiding? She's a sorceress. Can she, like, take on other shapes? Because she's, like, be a kitty cat. That's probably what I would do for the rest of my life. Just run around being a dog. Cats. Ah, I'm not a huge fan of dogs. Or cats, excuse me. I'm a much bigger fan of dogs. So I'll probably be a dog. Although I guess you'd have to have a good owner. Of course, I guess you could, like... Thank you. Let's go. Come human again and, like, murder your owner in the middle of the night. Oh, come on. What I wanted want to loot them bodies. No clue. First time I've laid eyes on them. Maybe. Well, recently someone's been trying to question our messengers about the young count. Hold on. Where's Miss Merigold? You would come alone, miss. If not for him, that trio would have dragged you in for questioning. The tall one was Valdo Morris. Works for the witch hunters. Aye. You're surely right, miss. I... It, it just weren't what I expected since Lady Bagel, bud. Now that we're past the initial courtesies, maybe you can tell us who you are. Lady Vagelbud's valet. I... I meant you no offense, sir. Why wouldn't Lady Vagelbud meet with me personally? She was afraid they'd follow her. Been a nervous wreck of her. So what's this about? Be straight. Lady Vagelbud's son. He's the... problem. Master Albert's taken an interest in alchemy. Temple Guard's got the wind. Wouldn't worry about the guard. But since the Mage Hunters tried to grab you, I'd say Albert's in serious trouble. Aye. Lady Vogelbud bought off the Guardsmen. But since the Hunters paid for every mage revealed to him... Guardsmen took a bribe from the frightened family, then whispered a word to the Hunters anyway. How'd Ingrid Vogelbud know to contact Triss? That Triss was the right person? We learned Miss Merigold had helped Myra Base disappear once the Witch Hunters were onto her. Myra provided Lady Ingrid with magical assistance on a few occasions with Milady's uh, afflictions. Makes sense. Myra mentioned treating a highborn lady to me once. Seems Albert needs to disappear as soon as possible. I can arrange that. Think young Vagelbud can slip out of the house unnoticed? Tain't that simple, sadly. Master Albert's in hiding at the Vagelbud's country estate. Lady Ingrid's got the notion she can get him out quietly. Wants to throw a lavish masquerade ball. Am I supposed to attend? Help him escape? I will not manage without you, miss. Lady Vogelbud fears the help's being watched. Oh, I don't know whether I should do this. I do want to just really quickly comment on the fact that I kept thinking he was calling her Vagel Butt, and I had to look down, and I was like, wait, no, it's Vagel Butt. Okay, okay. I was like, oh my god, it's vagal butt. Um, okay, so let's see. Uh, I don't know which one to do. Um, I guess we could do good idea. I mean, then we have to go to a party. That's a good idea. A boisterous bash. That'll distract the hunters. Especially if even half of what I've heard about the vagal butt's balls is true. Word is, at the last one, they served a hundred different desserts. And the fireworks boomed from dusk till dawn. What with the war and all, Milady's ordained but 85 desserts this time. Won't be no candied petals or blue roses from the Zare. The roses have become dreadfully hard to come by. Oh, I'd love to see it all. Hope we won't have to stay till the end. You're coming with me? Of course I am. Not about to send you into what could prove to be the lion's den by yourself. Think about it. 85 desserts. While well, you're still trying to keep your waist at 22 inches. Geralt, please. How do we get to the residence? Your invitation. Take it. Guard at the gate will have instructions for you. You're to wear a fox mask, alright? Good luck to you. Geralt, why do you know her waist size? And I gotta be honest, that seems like a very small waist size. All right, so can we head there now? I need to get something else done first. Ah, we can go there and get shit. Now. You're kidding, right? We have to prepare, change clothes, most importantly, buy our masks. I bet you can get everything we need for the ball at Ellie House shop. 
You know it? Been there before. Eliel's a friend of Dandelion's. Just masks, right? Probably don't need to wear a doublet, do I? A doublet, Geralt. And it's not up for discussion. Take care of that, then come and see me. Ugh, I have to go wear real clothes. I don't want to wear real clothes! I want to wear this! Wine, 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 wine! Sorry, I'm good at whining. Okay. Well, I guess we're gonna go and get some real clothes, look like a real person. That sounds insane to me. I think we should show up in full-on armor with two swords on my back, and I should just say fuck you all. But, you know, I don't think that's how it works. Oh! Something's going on then. We're not gonna mess with that right now. We are, we are not here for some other side quests. We're here for Fox Mass. Let's go ahead and keep going. I'll, I'll transition back when I get there. See you in a sec. Alright, ladies and gentlemen, here we are. We're almost there. Can I just take the stuff that's on the outside here? No? I mean, you left stuff outside. You should expect someone to steal it. It's kind of how it works. Greetings. Come to look over my spring collection, perhaps? I guess. Glad to take uh, a glance at what you got. Of course, please do. If anything chafes or pinches, I can alter it on the spot at no charge. Once I'm done, it'll feel like you're wearing nothing at all. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Giving me that crap. Oh, I gotta wear actual clothes. These things count? Probably not. Which one of these is the cheapest? Is one of them cheaper than the others? Yeah, this one's cheaper. There we go. And I need a fox mask. Should I buy a mask for myself? Do I need a do I need a mask? I don't know if I need a mask. Let's see. So long. I should have looked. Uh yeah, buy a mask. Buy a new outfit. Doublet, trousers, and boots. Greetings. Come to look over my spring collection. Right? Oh, I might as well get all of it. Oh man. Glad to take I'm just course, offended that do. I gotta dress that way. What can I say? I'm offended. Uh, how much are these? Let's see. Uh, da, da, da. I don't have a lot of money, you know, guys. Like, I'm really struggling with cash here. I reckon I gotta sell some stuff. I think wearing a wolf mask would be dumb. So I'm gonna do it. Because dumb is kind of my style. Let's see. Uh, 163, 163. So all the pantaloons cost the same, I guess. I got other pairs of boots. I guess we'll wear that. Then what about shoes? 85, 191. <laughs> this is insanity. I gotta spend all this money just so I can do some dumb stuff. Fine. I guess I'm gonna just sell you some random stuff you are not gonna use ever. Alright, I should have enough money to buy a dumb pair of shoes now. How much were these? Uh, 85. There we go. I can't believe how expensive those are. Fine. I bought everything I need. So long. Ah, I need to put it on. It's so gross. <laughs> I can't help it. Ah, oh, look at that. Look at that repulsive, repulsive junk. Oh, it's just offensive. Just offensive. All right. Well, let's go see Trey. She better appreciate me. I'm doing a lot for this girl. I wonder if, uh, you know, I think I remember, oh shit, I think I remember people talking about, it's, you can romance them in this game, I think it's her and Yennefer, right? You can romance them? Well, maybe that's what this is, if that's what this is, I'm, I've got no interest in romancing her, I can't help it, I don't like her. It's funny, I had somebody re uh, respond to one of my YouTube videos, and I really apologize, I can't remember who it was. But they were like, by the way, I don't, I don't get the, you know, the, the immediately, immediate dislike of Triss. I'm like, I don't know what you don't get about it. Oh, shut up. There's just some lady, or the, some lady, there's just something about that lady, like, I just don't like. Ooh. Oh, no. I, th I saw a little box and I was wondering if I could loot it. I don't know. Some people just rub you the wrong way. She rubs me the wrong way. Is she up here? Yeah, here we go. Oh my! Certainly took my request to heart. Mean you weren't being serious? Still got time to change. Don't you dare! You look great! 
You get everything? Everything's ready. We can go. A shame events like this are so rare. Without them, I'd never get to see you dressed up. Uh, damn doublets chafing my armpits. And it feels like they sewed wires into this. I'll be sure to admire your valiant suffering the whole time. Well then, shall we go? Greetings, my lord, my lady. We're Lady Ingrid Vagelbud's guests. Your invitation, please. Doors in order. You'll find Lady Vagelbud in the estate's yard. Look for the parrot mask. Uh, one more thing. Uh, leave your swords here, please. Fine. A pleasant evening to you both. Beautiful here. I haven't been outside the city in ages. Well, thank you so much for watching me play The Witcher 3 Wild Hunt. If you like this video, please remember to like, comment, and subscribe. It really does mean a lot to me. It definitely tells me what kind of content you guys want to see in the future. And guys, it is a huge motivation to keep moving forward. So thank you so much for being here. I really do appreciate it. If you want, you can go ahead and comment here on YouTube, or you can check me out over on Twitter. Engage with me over there at Amber from the Vault, spelt the same way as here. No O in from, no E in the. In the meantime, if you want to see more of The Witcher 3 Wild Hunt, go ahead and click on that playlist there that should be popping up in just a sec. There should also be a video that you YouTube thinks you'd like based on your viewing history, as well as a picture of my big dumb head. Click that, that will subscribe you to the channel so you can find out when I have new videos. Click the bell icon if you'd like to get those notifications. Thank you so much. I will see you all in the next one.